Hey guys, welcome back to another video. And if you're new here, my name is Edward Smith and welcome to my YouTube channel. And in today's video, we're going to be doing 2021's ultimate microphone comparison. So last year I did a video where I compared all the microphones that I own, put them to the test against one another to see how they sound at all different prices to hopefully help you pick which one you should get depending on your budget and what you're really looking for in terms of sound quality. But today's video is on another level. The variety and options that we have in this video compared to last year's has almost doubled from 6 microphones to 11 microphones ranging from $80 all the way up to $700 to hopefully help you pick the right microphone again for your budget and for your specific voice but without any further ado let's jump straight into the sound test the singing test and then afterwards i will go through these microphones and tell you exactly who i think each one is best suited for So the first microphone that I'm going to be talking through is the AKG P120 and this is what this microphone sounds like. I'm now talking through the Audio-Technica AT2020 and this is what this microphone sounds like. I'm now talking through the SE Electronics X1A and this is what this microphone sounds like. I'm now talking through the Rode NT1A and this is what this microphone sounds like. I'm now talking through the Lewitt LCT 440 Pure and this is what this microphone sounds like. I'm now talking through the Blue Bluebird SL and this is what this microphone sounds like. I'm now talking through the SE Electronics SE2200 and this is what this microphone sounds like. I'm now talking through the Aston Origin and this is what this microphone sounds like. I'm now talking through the Rode NT2A and this is what this microphone sounds like. I'm now talking through the Sennheiser MK8 and this is what this microphone sounds like. I'm now talking through the Neumann TLM102 and this is what this microphone sounds like. They say, oh my god, I see the way you shine. Take your hand, my dear, and place them both in mine. You know you stopped me dead when I was passing by But now you beg to see me dance just one more time Oh, I see you, see you, see you every time And oh my eye, oh my eye, I like your style You, you make me, make me, make me wanna cry But now you beg to see me dance just one more time so they say, dance for me, dance for me, dance for me, oh, oh I've never seen anybody do the things you do before oh, They said, move for me, move for me, move for me, eh, eh And when you're done, I'll make you do it all again so now that we've gone through these microphones in terms of the talking test and the singing test, it's time to move on to the part where I tell you exactly who I think each microphone is best suited for. And starting off with the AKG P120, I think this microphone is fantastic for the price. If you're someone looking to get an $80 microphone for your startup home studio setup, looking to get a condenser microphone because you want cleaner and crisper vocals, this is a great microphone to go for. Moving on to the AC Electronics and the Audio-Technica AT2020, these are our $100 microphones which is just a little bit of a jump up from the AKG P120, a little bit clearer, a little bit more crisp, with the AC Electronics you're going to get a little bit more low end and with the AT2020 you're going to get a better overall balance in terms of sound but also that same bracket. If you're someone looking to build a home studio setup, get a quality microphone at a really good price, these two or these three actually are great options. When you move on to the Rode NT1A and the Lewitt LCT440 Pure, these two microphones range from $220 to $270, where you're really getting the best in terms of sound quality for the money that you're paying. The Rode NT1A for me is one of the best microphones on the market that you can go for, for vocals, for acoustic guitar, for anything that you want to record, this microphone delivers every single time. It's so crisp, it's so clean, it's just one of 
the best to go for. When you look at the Lewitt LCT440 Pure, it's also a very good sounding microphone, maybe a little bit smoother around the edges in terms of the vocal quality and pickup than that of the Rode NT1A, but also a quality microphone with exceptional sound. And then moving on to the Aston Origin, the Blue Bluebird SL and the SE Electronics 2200, these are our $300 microphones, which I think is the perfect place to be looking for a microphone if you are around that price range, because it's not too expensive and it's also not too cheap and you're really gonna get a quality microphone that's gonna last you forever these microphones sound super flat they sound really really good in terms of your highs and your lows and you're really getting a clear crisp pickup with a lot of switches as well like attenuation and roll of switch which is just additional features to help you get the most out of the microphone that you're buying then we move on to the Rode NT2A, which is our $400 microphone, which isn't that much different in terms of sound quality from our $300 microphones. But the reason it is more expensive is because you got a little bit more versatility with this microphone where you're getting a whole bunch of polar patterns. So a card weight polar pattern where you, everything is picked up all around. You're getting an eight figure pattern where you can pick it up on both sides or your standard unidirectional picker pattern right from the front. So it has a little bit more versatility and for that you're paying that extra $100. But like like I said, in terms of sound quality, it's still exceptional, but not that much better than our $300 microphones. And then moving on to our $700 microphones, which consist of the Sennheiser MK8 and the Neumann TLM102. These microphones definitely sound the best by far. Neumann TLM102 is just hitting all of these out of the park, mainly because of its pickup. It sounds so, so clean and smooth at the same time. It is a Neumann microphone, so you can only expect the best. And for vocal recording, you're not gonna get a better microphone with better value and better quality than the Neumann TLM102. When you look at the Sennheiser MK8, this microphone doesn't sound as good as the Neumann TLM102. It doesn't even sound that much better than our other microphones ranging from $300 to $400. But the thing that makes this microphone so expensive and so unique and exceptional is the amount of polar patterns and roll-off and all of these kind of extra things that it has for more versatility. This microphone has five different polar pickup patterns compared to the Rode NT2A3. So you are paying a lot more for that. Plus it does sound better than these microphones overall, but not that much like the Neumann TLM102 that has no extra features or anything like that. It's just the best sounding small little microphone that you could ever get. So that brings our ultimate microphone comparison for 2021 to an end and I hope you guys enjoyed it and just a reminder that if you are interested in any of these products I will leave them linked down in the description below. If you have any questions about anything, any microphone just leave a comment down below and I'll try and get back to you as soon as I can but other than that thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it please give it a thumbs up and if you loved it subscribe down below and I will see you for another video next time.